I told you earlier, I depend on my put my entire life into the Word of God. That it will bring me through. Hallelujah. I believe every word of it. And I believe it will all come to pass. I don't want nobody to add anything to it or take anything away from it. And I don't care about anybody's opinion of it either. I just want to tell you that it's the Word of God tonight. And that's why we're here tonight. I hope that this group will uh, be a blessing to you. Ryan, I don't mean to preach. You better stop me. These boys won't, I can tell. Yeah, tell us a little bit about the group. All right. Amen. Thank you so much. What a pleasure it is to sing with uh, a crowd that we can tell loves the Lord and is happy to be in God's house tonight. I want to take just a moment. We're not going to take a lot of time with this, but I would like to tell you who the guys are. So when you go back and you see them after the concert, you can <coughs> call them by name instead of, hey, you. We'll start with uh, Mr. Excited here. He's uh, he's worked up. Y'all got to be careful. We don't get him too worked up quick because he only goes for so long. He's not like that Energizer Bunny. He don't just keep going and going. We got to wind him back up. So he is the uh, he's the baritone singer for the group. He's also the manager and owner of the group. At this time, he's the only original member of the group that was started eight years ago that's left. And uh, the the uh, other former member had stepped down this time. They got this old. Year. Yeah, he just he outlived them all. They thought they were going to beat him, but man, God has a funny sense of humor, and he let him go. Um, but he. Uh, he does all of the booking. He does all the legwork, the office work. If you ever call the office, you're going to get a hold of him. So for forewarning you and a fair warning to you, if you don't want to talk, don't call the office. <laughs> but he does a great job. We love him, and he, he's, uh, he's obviously very excited and pleased to be Amen. knowing the Lord and Amen. Christ and in his life tonight. Amen. Would you make a welcome, Brother D. Cooper? Amen. How'd y'all like it on the last song? Did he do all right? He did a good job, did he? He is, uh, he's the newest member of the group. Step on out there. Let him get a look at you. Sing it again. <laughs> Don't say that. He will. He is the newest member of the group. This is his fourth concert with the group. He's only been in four concerts Amen. with us now, and I think he's doing a fantastic Amen. job. And obviously, you guys do too. You enjoy his singing, which you make welcome tonight. Brother Frankie Powell. Yeah. This guy at the end, he was the newest member until Frankie stepped up and he graciously dropped that title as quick as he could. He dropped it like it was hot and then, and then some. He was not liking that after a little while. He got over it real quick. He is our tenor singer. He is what we call the miracle guy of the group. Um, we'll tell you a little bit later about that. There's a story that goes along with it, and I'm sure if time permits, we'll, we'll have him uh, share his testimony with you. It's, it's very, very emotional, and it's a very powerful testimony. It's something, you know, that not everybody can share. I don't know if you remember the people that are closer to my age, and I, they may have done this back then, too, but they brought, they brought people into our high school that went through life-changing situations and had them minister to the people there at the school. And he, he definitely has this situation. We're going to let him share that in just a little while, but he is our tenor singer. He does a fantastic job. If you're enjoying him tonight, would you make Amen. welcome Brother Gary Franklin. Amen. My name is Ryan Johns. I sing the bass part, and that makes up the Hearts of Harmony. If you're glad to see him, would you let the guys know it one more time? 